where are you going? Lucy's teaching me, Charlie Brown. She says the sister is responsible for the education of her little brother. So she's teaching me. Boy, she intelligent. Come on, Linus. Do you see this tree? It's called a fir tree. It's called a fir tree because it gives us fur for coats. And it also gives us wool in the winter time. I never knew that before, Lucy. That's very interesting. This is an elm tree. It's very little. But it will grow up into a giant tree. And oh, you can tell how old it is by counting its leaves. Now wait a minute, Lucy. I don't mean to interfere, but I don't think that's correct. And we are So? Yes! They went around all day long tugging and tugging on each tiny seedling until they grow into a great fine dry blade of grass! Boy, that's amazing! Oh, good grief! Ugh. And this thing here, it's called a hydrant. They grow all over and no one seems to know just how. A little thing like that makes so much water. Do you see that bird? It's called an eagle. But since it's little, it's got another name, a sparrow! And on Christmas and Thanksgiving, we eat them. Now, Lucy, how can you say that? I'm sorry, but I can't just stand idly by. Way up there, those little stars and planets make the rain that falls in showers. And when it's cold and winter is upon us, the snow comes up, just like the flowers. Now, Lucy, I know that's wrong. Snow doesn't come up, it comes down. After it comes up, the wind blows it around so it looks like it's coming down, but actually it comes up out of the ground like grass. Snow comes up, Charlie Brown, it comes up. Oh, good grief. <laughs> Lucy, why is Charlie Brown banging his head against that tree? To loosen the bark to make the tree grow faster. Clouds can make the wind blow, bugs can make the grass grow. So, there you go. These are 